Who the fuck are you? See you rangers. Hoping to get to Colorado Springs any day now. A little trading with you. Thanks, Rangers. We won't let the others talk you. Oh, thank you. It ain't much. Might as well keep it because why the fuck not? Okay. Throw the yellow star. Quickly. <laughs> they used to track Santa here. What? Alright, uh, okay. This is wrong. You can't keep the holy detonation to yourselves. Blasphemy! The sacred glow belongs to the nucleus alone. The glow belongs to everyone. The angel has spoken. You will all be cast out to die in the wasteland with the rest of the unworthy. Stop this. There's no need for violence. Such a fucking bullshit.
There's a question, does this damage or is an enemies, but this is the uh do burn out. Does not damage my this wood. I should change it back. Probably won't be able to do it here, but <clears throat> it is strong. But I, the better one is definitely. Hello again, Rangers. I'm glad you made it. Oh, I'm sorry you weren't able to save my new acquaintance, Carp. Now that it's over, however, I fear there's another problem. The villains you defeated have locked Cheyenne's door against their rivals and us. It will take some effort to reopen. Oh, no. Brother Carbuncle had barely introduced me to them before their rivals attacked. They seemed nice enough, though, despite their odd looks. It appears the power source we're looking for has spawned religious fervor among the people living here. When the Primordialists brought me here, they discovered that the ones called the Nucleus had put themselves between us and the door. And when the Primordialists inquired as to the motive for this strange action, Radio calls from the Primordialist comrades during the hostilities suggest the struggle goes on inside as well. 
making the Primordialists extremely anxious to open the door. Ah, well, there you have me. Having only just arrived myself, I have no idea. All I can say so far is that the... Maybe if we get inside, there will be someone there who can give you an answer. Here's the passcode from the old documentation I found. If it still works, I assume you would enter it into the keypad next to the airlock. I don't know. I suppose... Oh, great. I have uh, absolutely no idea. It looks like cancerous flesh. Dis Thank you. And hurry if you good luck. I will probably be killing them all. Because as it would seem they are completely off the rails because of the radiation. When I take the radiation away or dismantle it, it's not gonna go down well. No? Oh, right. I need another one. Because the goddamn dumbest deer killed himself. Yeah, okay. I went with saving. Rangers. Oh, I'm glad you made it. Let me introduce you to my new acquaintance. Brother, er, Carbuncle of the Primordialists, who came out with his friend. Hey, thanks for defending us. No way we'd have survived without your help. I wish I could welcome you to our home, but. What? Oh, uh, I don't suppose you'd be willing to. <clears throat> it will also help us get closer to our goal. Uh, yes. I know you explained it to me. Sure. Okay. So I'm Brother Karma, and my friends and I are primordialists. The ones we fought are nucleists. See, in the beginning was the holy detonation, and us worshippers were called primordialists. But one of us, Deuterium, started saying the world wasn't worthy of the glow. And we should keep it to ourselves. We called that heresy. So he went off and since then the peaceful paradise that Cheyenne Mountain used to be has become... Oh, I am. I'm just devolved. Gloriously devolved, Father Bezor says. Mutation hits us all differently and I went down the proto drool path. Eventually, I'll just be a big blob of <laughs> proto- Fascinating. That was <laughs> Deuterium picking his moment. Up till now, there's been no fighting between the two sides, but I... I guess he... He must have heard our call to Theo here, saying we'd uh, come out to welcome him. Because when we got back, the Nucleus... My dear friend, uh, I am so sorry. It's not your fault, Theo. But we gotta hurry back inside. They're attacking our camp in there. I heard our brothers and sisters calling for us on the walkie. That damn Deuterium's trying to wipe us out once and for all. Oh, that's a tumor colony. They form all over the place in Cheyenne Mountain. Kinda hard to clear them once they gather like that. Sister Melanoma could tell you more about them once we get inside. Yeah. Uh, some mutations are more useful than others, right? You get enough radiation in you, and it can come back out and all. Oh, great. Oh, 
embrace the great glow. Thank you, friends. Here's just be prepared for more fighting. I'm done, friends. One step closer. There you go. <clears throat> Thought it might be smarter if I get them to survive. 